woke me by singing. Oh, what can I say? I'm blissful. Things are great at work. I have you guys, and Andrea gave me a raise. Time to redecorate. Does this mean you're gonna be painting? Uh, it means we're gonna be painting. Ooh, I'd love to, but I hate painting. Mm -hmm, me too. You're on your own, Paigey. Come on, guys. It'll be fun. Any excuse to spend time in Paige Michael Chuck's bedroom, huh? Can you blame him? I'm fabulous. So, are you guys in? Fine. Yeah, fine. Hey, Paige, are we uh, still on for the bed later? Mm, absolute mo. Bed? Uh, yeah, roommate etiquette? You didn't even check with us. Relax, Eleanor. We're going to Ikea. He's helping me get in bed. Uh, A bed. I swear. Sisters? Ugh. No, it's just me and my dad. He's really amazing. Did you see your mom a lot? Not really. What about the Michael Chucks? Uh, my parents are gradually getting over the fact that their son moved to Europe to play hockey. And left poor Marco behind? Marco's fine. He finally cut the cord, moved the last of his things from Dylan's former room, and now I have a blank slate. How'd your parents deal with having two gay kids? I mean, you and... Alex? AKA the only girl I was ever into. Yeah, make that one gay kid and one undecided. Okay, you guys have two hours starting right now. So we ready to paint this town? Truffle mint. Check it out. Decent. Bit of a butter face. <laughs> What's that? Yeah. Is that like some weird old guy thing? OK. Everything's good about her. Yeah. But her face. Get it? But her face. <laughs> Lame. Lame. Focus on this instead, OK? Seriously, guys, the sausage fest is getting kind of tired. You know, with aim like that, you'd do awesome in the archery club. Like bows and arrows archery? The club just started at school. Mm. Flying arrows are strangely therapeutic. You should come. <laughs> Sounds medieval. I'm in. are dying. Can we just be done? Sure, hon. Thank you. <clears throat> so, like what you see? Um, I I'm not sure. It's a smidge mintier than I expected. When you have visitors? Yeah? They're not gonna be looking at the walls. Okay, speaking of visitors, let's not Overstay our welcome. We have so much cleaning up to do. All right. Remind me not to mess with you like ever. You are dangerous. It's new fam talent. <laughs> it's good, Darcy, but remember to keep your elbow up. Jane, you ready? Mm-hmm. Here you go. Oh, 
Wow. From now on, I'm packing a bow. <laughs> Plus, it's uh, nice to have a boyfriend for his zone every once in a while. Peter's my partner for English. Does he need a talking to? Or, or an arrow, maybe. <laughs> no, he's great. It's just every once in a while. Forget it. Yeah, come on, you can tell me. It's like, OK, with Spin, if it weren't for his pit stains, he'd be perfect. Wow, you guys were made for each other. I was only going to tell you about Peter's breath. <laughs> oh. Forget I said that. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Go get it. As long as we're telling secrets, um, that ass is my brother. That creep? Yeah. I'm not exactly proud of it. But your last name? Oh, I changed it. Um, my real name is actually Anastasia Valieri. That's a big one, Anastasia. Shoot it out, girl. Let me guess. As they do, and you're waiting for the caffeine to kick in. Waiting for you, mostly. You got a minute? Yeah, just came into 15. <sighs> What's up, Captain Longface? Nothing. I just, I wanted to run something by you. Totes. Everything OK? It's kind of scary to talk about. And... I don't really want to freak you out, but, well, you're starting to. Come on, just spill it already. Marco, I have... Oh, feelings for Paige. <laughs> what, that's it? Oh, man, come on, you had me scared for a second there. Yeah, so, so what do you think? I love that girl. So, if you hurt her, I take drastic measures. Well, totally. I get that. Improv scenes continue. Peter and Jane at Harlequin and Columbine. Looks like Comedy Dollar to next. <laughs> Fair miss, I beseech you, love me. But my father will be displeased. Let me whisper a secret. Oh, damn, no keeping that jungle breath a secret, right? <laughs> <laughs> Let's get back on track, please. Peter, wait up. I have to get to class later. Who knew Peter could be so pouty? You so don't get it, Jane. Why do you have to be such a girl? Hello? Guys? Oh, man, I'm hungry. Pitch? Hey. A surprise for you. Ready? Uh-huh. So what do you think? This is gorgeous. I can't believe you did this. How did you do this? Fast. Alan <laughs> Key Callus. Oh. So do you like your room? See if you can guess. Paige, hold on. Are you sure? Oh, God. Uh, you don't want this. No, I do. A lot. Ever since the first roommate interview. So then why all the talking and not the kissing? Just checking.
You leaving? So soon? I was trying to be quiet. So you could sneak out? So I could let you sleep. Let's order another wake-up call. Can't. I gotta meet with my prof. You're gonna be late, Al. Don't you want to get the good seats? It's linguistics class, Marco, not a movie. Here's your coffee mug. You got your bag? I'm going. Bye. All right. I should jet to class while the coast is clear. See you tonight. Telling Jimmy about how you totally burned Peter in class. Hilarious. Mm. Too bad Darcy's in a snit about it. How come? I guess I wasn't supposed to say anything about her hating his stank breath, but whatever. She'll get over it. Darcy Edwards. No, she won't. Well, maybe. Did you apologize at least? Well, I told her she was mad over nothing and to stop being such a girl. <laughs> this is why I can't deal with girls. They're just so sensitive, you know? I definitely think you're gonna have to do some digging to get out of this one. I feel weird going through his stuff. It's not like I went looking for it, but I, I can't unknow this now. I told him if he hurt you, I'd kill him. 3TC, ABC, maybe, maybe it's vitamins or weightlifting stuff. Yeah, and he packs them in little prescription bottles just to be quirky. <sighs> What if he's sick? What if he has got cancer or something? I don't know why he'd hide that. Do you have any idea what this is? F A Z T. Where have I heard that before? Oh my God. Marco. It's the HIV cocktail. He came to my work to ask if you two could... But if I had known this, it... wow. Okay, I got an emergency text minutes before class. Why? Griffin has HIV. We found his drugs. What? Are you guys sure? Yes! Ellie, is that emergency enough for you? Paige, calm down. I can't calm down. How could he not tell me? Well? Well? There is no well, Marco. Uh, we all drink from the same OJ carton. Ellie, you can't. I know, I know there's no way to pass it like that, but still, it's disturbing. Well, since I slept with him, I think I can relate to your concerns. It just kind of happened. You use protection, though, right? Of course, but there's no guarantees, and I swore I would never be out of control with a guy again. Paige, if he used a condom... He still took a risk, Marco. He took a risk with my life. Paige? Guys? Hey, hey, has anybody seen my wallet? When were you gonna tell me? You can't run away from this, Griffin. I can't believe you went through my stuff. I, I think yours is the bigger faux pas here. I meant to tell you. The time just never seemed right. Well, it doesn't matter because now I have to suffer your stupid choices in lifestyle. Lifestyle? Y you just assume it's my lifestyle? Well, isn't it? Go to hell.
Would it make it easier if you pretend my face is on the target? Kind of, yes. So unless you want to be the target, move. Darcy, listen, please. I'm sorry I busted you on Peter's halitosis, okay? But, but I got super strong mints, so. <laughs> Are you for real? I didn't tell you about this so you could fix it. There's a problem. I'm offering you a solution. I didn't want a solution. I wanted you to listen. What if I told all these eavesdroppers about your evil brother? Would that help to fix things, make you feel better? Darcy, please. Jane, relax. I'm not going to. No friend, girl or guy, would do that, which is what makes you and I very different. How long ago do you think you may have been exposed? Last night. We used a condom, but I still want to check. What? HIV antibodies take up to six months to show up. We'll know more then. I won't know for six months. But the good news is you took precautions. source of support. You're not going to talk to me? Maybe in six months. It's great. You're not even going to ask how I got it? What, too many girls, too few condoms? Oops. I was born HIV positive. What is this? My mother's obituary. She was a junkie. Tried to stop after I was born, but couldn't. I never even met her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. You didn't ask. Well, even if I had, would you have had the guts to tell me? I've been in a healthy sexuality program for years. They teach you how to have these conversations, but it doesn't make it any easier. I am not wrong to be scared. I know. Neither am I. For the record, what you did was not cool. I know. Darcy, I'm an idiot. <sighs> but thanks. Kissing Peter did get a little bit more fun. Mm. Look, um, can we make me like a friendship trainee? Because clearly I'm an ignoramus. Will you help me? I don't know. What if I say something sacred and you say that's stupid, then what? Mm. Arrow to the head? Look, I, I guess I want a friend more than I thought. Kind of a lot more. OK, you nut bar, we can try. That's rad. OK, lesson one, friends can hug. <laughs> Arco says you're leaving. You should have told me. Things were going so well, I didn't want to ruin it. You'd be surprised how quickly the truth makes people run away. Yeah, well, so do lies. Everything's always so complicated with me. I mean, the HIV makes everything complicated. You weren't honest with me. You didn't let me choose. But, but I'm not mad you have HIV. You know, some days, 
I forget that I have it. I mean, I've never even been sick. The drugs work. We have a lot to talk about. Which will be harder if you go. Don't move out, please. It's not gonna be weird if I stay? <sighs> Let's be honest, it's gonna be weird either way. But I wanna try to work through this. You are amazing. <laughs> this is nothing. Way do you get to know me? Get used to this babysitting gig. Jack in bed. Your parents on their date. Too bad you need to sneak out as soon as they get home. Yeah, school board policy. Only until my dad's name is cleared. Well, what do you expect when they get the Oh my god, the they're all confusion. Yep, that's my cue. For you. You know, you didn't have to be so rude to that waiter. I wasn't rude. His snotty attitude reminds me of why I cook at home. <laughs> His attitude or your paranoia? Oh, right, because I imagine everything, like being falsely accused of sexual assault, maybe? Have fun on your date? It's nothing, Emma. We're fine. That's your ring. Hello? Speaking? Right? Thank you. That was my lawyer. So, what has two thumbs and is officially not a pedophile? This guy. You've been cleared? That's amazing. <laughs> I told you to stay positive, but did you believe me? <laughs> Fresh start and the sweet smell of vindication. It's the parking lot, not the Green Mile. I'm fine. Mr. Rush, you're letting your run loose. Nice to see you too, Lucas. Perf says what? What? <laughs> <laughs> Losers, just ignore them. <laughs> what a bird. Um, maybe it's too soon, Emma. Well, what'll people think if you chicken out? Won't that be worse? I I'm sorry, Emma. I I'm not convinced that I belong at Degrassi anymore. Well, what can I do to convince you? You better get to class. Um, I'm gonna call Miss H. Most of you did very well. But for those who are having trouble, you know the answer. Tutoring works. 
85. I'm so cramped for this. Amazing. And please, 86%. Do not be afraid to get Holly J, how did you do? These equations are the basis for advanced level calculus. Anya, for my sake, so could you, you at least try to stop now, being so boring? Just going to fall Let's figure out what we're going to do tonight. Oh, um, didn't I tell you uh, Sav and I are going out? Lucas is taking Isabella and me for pizza. We could so double. We could double. Ugh, greasy food and greasy company. Try to aim up, girls. Although, considering the boys in question, you're doing the best you can. Somebody's single and bitter. Somebody's baby daddy's a Neanderthal. Holly J, you can come too. Just because you're single, it won't be weird. <laughs> Got better things to do, thanks. Like what? A big solitaire tournament? Oh, Mia, when do you shoot your pilot for the Not Funny Network? <laughs> Um, I can leave if you want. Actually, I was looking for you. Not to kill me, I hope. No, Darcy. I am so sorry for putting your family through all this. I know you've been through a lot. It's no excuse for falsely accusing your dad. I was, I was in a bad place and I panicked and... It's okay. He's been cleared officially, the school board called. Oh, that's amazing, when's he coming back? That's the thing. I don't think he wants to. Why? He's not sure he belongs at Degrassi anymore, that everyone will want him back. He's such a great teacher, of course they will. Exactly. That is where you come in. Anything. I'll do it. Show Mr. Simpson how much you miss him. Show one of Degrassi's best how much you care. Where do I sign? Anywhere. Thanks, Manny. And I'll sign another name with my left hand. Mrs. J. Hogart. Have fun explaining that one to him. Get Simpson back to Degrassi. Hey, you guys, do you want to sign Simpson's card, show him your support? So we can have a pedophile in our school. No thanks. If you get anywhere near my kid. You have a kid? Oh. Oh. Mr. Simpson is not a pedophile. You're a stepdaughter. You have to defend him. I'm defending him, too. <laughs> okay, you said that he did something, then you said he didn't. It's hard to know what's the truth. I'm sorry. We know the truth. <sighs> yeah. And remember, yearbooks don't sell themselves. To think. A few weeks, my role will be entrusted to one of these infants. Little Sinclair could be your heir. Oh, perish the thought. Eek. I think she saw me. Look. Wait, Liberty, don't leave me with her. Toby Isaacs, right? I need to ask you something. Fantastic. I need help in math. My sister said you're the nerdiest. I mean, the best tutor. Heather Sinclair said that? Among other things. Look, I have cash. And her out. You know what, forget the money. How about I scratch your back, you scratch mine? Oh, God. What is it going to take, Archie? You've seen how worked up Emma is. I know, but it's not about her. It's affecting her. Can't you see she's trying to control things? Don't blame me, OK? You know what happens, Archie. She's a recovering anorexic. All right. If I go back, how am I going to save face, huh? How? You just do it. I had to, if you remember. Are you going to bring up my 30 seconds of stupidity with Daphne over and over again? Well, it depends. Are you going to tell me the real reason you're afraid to go back? What? If I molested a student? Hmm? If I'm some kind of sexual predator? No, but maybe, maybe you weren't careful enough. I mean, are you sure you didn't give the girl the wrong idea? I did nothing wrong, Spike. How can you even ask me that? Where are you going? Get some air. OK, so just insert the Y value, and voila. <laughs> if Armstrong had taught it like that, maybe I'd understand it. Yeah, well, Armstrong would have to learn it himself first. Don't you hate being such a mathlete? It's all relative. I mean, I'd hate to go up and bounce around in front of the whole school every week, but you love it. 
Spirit Squad, it's really the only time you're not scowling. Hmm. Ten years of jazz and five years of tap taught me to save your smiles for when they count. So do I get one for getting you through your next math test? When I ace it? <laughs> so I believe we had a deal. I'm not giving you my underwear. Good. I did. You ever heard of Dance Dance Revolution? Seriously? Yeah. You're back. Thank you for doing this. 300 reasons to go back to Degrassi. So, will I see you tomorrow? I don't think so. Just suck it up, Snake. They want you back. I know this has been hard for you. Everything at school and... No, oh, it's not just that. It's... You're sleeping on the couch. Is it that bad between you and Mom? How worried should I be? Listen, tomorrow I'll go back to work, all right? And this will all start to get better. It better. Good night. I teach him immersion, media styles. Surprise. Why didn't you tell me he was back? We missed you so much. Oh, OK, no touching. That's the kind of stuff that got me in this mess. Right, sorry. <laughs> See, it's not so bad. I believe it's what the kids call sucking it up. So the student becomes the teacher. Not for long. Take a seat, Miss Nelson. this and I flunked his ed, so seriously. Forward, right, left, right, no, forward, backwards, no. other backwards. <laughs> Something should be done in the privacy of the home. Yeah, it does kind of give a whole new meaning to dance like nobody's watching. <laughs> Why is something that's so hard for me so easy for everyone else? Hey, story of my life. When Heather was here, she was smart and popular and cute. Yeah, well, now you're here. You're filling her shoes. Holly J, you coming to French? I try to help and you grope me? You, Mr. Simpson. What is it with you digi pervs? Looks like you'll be failing PE, Toad. Yeah, I get it. Now, the lesson here is never underestimate the power of the student. Yahoo, Facebook, know. Google, all created by students. Have you ever searched your name, Mr. S? <laughs> um, not recently. Well, there's a web page. You should check it out. Close it, Lucas. Emma, I can handle this. <laughs> you get yourself down to Hot Slarkos. I was just, I said, now! Looks like she came to me. You stay put, I'll deal with you in a minute. Everything okay? Everything's fine. 
first day back must be a lot of pressure. I'm okay. Really. Um, one thing, though, the, uh, the class list. Lee Croft and she, she isn't on it. She decided to withdraw. Do I need to ask why? Her parents didn't give a reason, but they don't have to. I guess I can't blame them, can I? I mean, if I were in their shoes, I... They don't know you, Archie. I do. And I know you won't let this get to you. as long as no one's around, right? Otherwise, social suicide. Stop being so pouty. You think you're the first girl to pull a stunt like this? Well, excuse me for having a reputation to protect. Protect? From <laughs> whom? Or who. I need to be Holly J. Sinclair for my friends. Really? I think if you drop the bitch act, they'd actually like you. I might. Oh, and by the way, it's for whom? I heard a crash. I dropped some ice. It's three in the morning. I know. Go back to bed. Don't believe everything you see on the internet. Isn't that what you teach us on day one? Sometimes the HTML doesn't lie. Wow, so that's it? If I'd known going back to Degrassi would make you this crazy, I never would have made that stupid card. I'm not trying to disappoint you. Then don't. Just go back to work tomorrow. That's all it takes. OK. I will. Good night. can't make it today, I will be covering for him again. What's going on? Where is he? I don't ask questions. So I believe we have what? Photo essays, according to Mr. Simpson's lesson plan number 117. Never forget I'm a genius, Anya. Wow. Sure looks like that tutoring paid off. You're like the Toby of our class. <laughs> Anya, do you realize how dumb some of the things you say are? Sorry, you're nothing like Toby. He's disgusting. No, oh, Anya. He's not disgusting. He's geek chic. He might be rich one day like Bill Gates. OK, so we like him now, then. Try to keep up, Anya. We might like him, yes. OK. Perfect. Don't go to work. Stay home and get wasted. And once cars smash into each other, it's awesome. You're a coward. You think this morning, I got up and I grabbed my laptop and I tried because you wanted me to. I couldn't even get out the door. What if mom sees you like this? Well, maybe she needs to, hmm? <laughs> Fine. Wallow in self-pity. You know, when bad things happen to me, you tell me to be strong, but you're not strong. You're a hypocrite. Maybe. I'm sorry. Archie? What is this? It's fine, Mom. Are you drunk? I'm sorry. I failed you guys. You didn't fail. You gave up. You're trying to run away from your problems. Kids shouldn't see this. Look, I'll be fine, Christine, OK? I just need a day to get my head on. I think the kids and I should go stay with my mom for a while. Mom, don't overreact. Emma, I'm your mother. And being around this, this environment, I just think we might need some time away.
Well, my test was a success, all so thanks to my super tutor. A little privacy from your man-made fibers, please. My pleasure. I'll let you guys talk. Listen, we can be seen together. It's out in the open. Some people think I'm kind of a loser. And until, what, like 10 seconds ago, weren't you one of them? Well, I changed my mind, lowered my standards, because I like you. <laughs> Wrong answer, Holly J. It would be so sweet to have a girlfriend, but it just can't be you. No, you don't understand. I made everything OK. I told my friends. But I don't care who you told. This is about you. It's about me. And your poor self-esteem? Get over it, Toby. I mean, it doesn't matter what you think. If people see you with me, they'll worship you. Not the people I care about. Who, Liberty? Please. Look, you had your shot with me, and you blew it. Toby Isaacs calls the shots. <sighs> Anya, come over tonight. I don't care, ditch him. We need to talk about this disturbing new dependence on boys. Didn't expect you to be at. I'd, uh, wallowed in self-pity long enough. So are you going to try again? I do want to go back, you know. But not yet. I thought I could do this on my own, but, uh, I can't. The union has counselors, so, um, we're going to talk. Where's your bag? Come on, Em, pack your things, let's go. I'm not going. Um, you don't have to stay, Emma. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I can't just stand by and watch our family fall apart. Em, you need to take care of yourself. I know, you're worried about me trying to control things. But the one thing I can do is stay here, and so can you. I'm sorry, Emma, but I need to take care of myself, too. I'll call you tonight. Your mom and I, we just, we need some time. Thanks for staying with me. I believe in you, Dad. Don't make me regret it. 